Hi, I'm Mike McNamara. Small business owners and office managers looking for a new all-in-one printer have lots of models to choose from. But if you're on a tight budget, then you should consider the new Epson Workforce Pro WP4530 or the HP OfficeJet Pro 8600 Plus all-in-ones. Both of these models feature incredibly fast one- and two-sided print speeds, water-resistant inks, high-resolution scanning and copying up to legal size, faxing, and wireless printing from mobile devices such as iPads and smartphones. But which is the best choice for your office? The proof is in the printing, scanning, and copying, and the features that save you both time and printing costs. Let's take a closer look at both models. As you can see, these printers have very different looks, with the Epson a bit higher and narrower than the HP. The HP has a large 4.3 inch color touchscreen panel on front, compared to the Epson's monochrome 2.5 inch LCD and quick access buttons. The touchscreen is neat, but it can take more time to navigate menus and perform several common tasks, such as copying the PC, than it does on the Epson. On top of both is an auto document feeder, and below it, a high resolution flatbed scanner, which is legal size on the HP, although the Epson scans up to legal size using its auto document feeder. The Epson also features a specialty paper feed for thicker papers and envelopes. Both models include USB 2.0 Ethernet and fax connectors on the back and around the front. Both have doors that swing open to change printer inks, which you'll probably do less frequently and faster on the Epson, thanks to its high-yield, spring-loaded replacement cartridges. The Epson also has a USB jack for scanning to USB thumb drives, while the HP includes a multi-card reader for printing from or scanning to memory cards, and you can view the images on your card on the 4.3-inch LCD monitor. Built-in Wi-Fi is a prized office feature found on both of these printers and setup can be done in as little as a few seconds using the printer controls and router WPS buttons. In the office, Epson's free iPrint app for Mac and Android devices lets you print or scan wirelessly from a 4530, and even print or scan to online storage sites such as Google Docs, BoxNet, and Dropbox. And you can also use Apple's AirPrint to print wirelessly from a number of Mac programs. The HP also allows you to print or scan from wireless computers in the office and allows you to access internet printing apps directly from the printer's LCD monitor. However, many of these apps require subscriptions, while others do little more than compile blogs and articles that must be printed out in order to read. Which is the fastest of these two all-in-ones? In print speed tests using the ISO 24734 four-page document, the Epson was fastest in single and two-sided black and white printing, as well as two-sided color printing. The HP won in the single-sided color, giving the Epson the speed advantage in three out of four speed tests, and placing both printers in direct speed competition with laser printers costing twice as much. By the way, to view these speed tests at normal speed, click on the timer in the center or on the links in the YouTube description. Now, in copy speed tests using the same four-page ISO document, the results were nearly the opposite of the print speed tests, with the HP beating out the Epson in all but the two-sided black and white copy tests. But that copy speed advantage comes at a price and image quality, as I'll show you in the next segment. In single-sided color and black and white documents made on plain papers, both printers produced fonts that were well-formed and readable. However, the Epson's black inks were measurably darker on all the plain papers I tested, including those with color lock coatings used here, and therefore produced fonts and images with better contrast than the HP. In copied documents, Epson's darker blacks and slightly higher color ink saturation were more noticeable in the fonts, color charts, and photos in the ISO document. And with default settings, the HP popped out closer to draft quality copies, with notable streaking on both one- and two-sided copies. And finally, in image quality comparisons made on matte and glossy photo papers, the Epson print showed slightly more pleasing contrast, higher detail and color saturation, as well as a much wider gamut on glossy photo papers. However, the HP gets bonus points for its ability to print high quality borderless photos. As these tests and comparison photos show, higher print and copy speeds don't always equate to higher image quality. In this case, the Epson Workforce Pro WP4530 does a better job at delivering both than the HP. However, the HP OfficeJet Pro 8600 Plus does let you print from memory cards and run internet printing apps without a computer. But in a busy multi-user office environment, these extras might not be as coveted as the higher performance and image quality you get from the Epson. For more information on either of these printers, including a close look at what comes in the box, click on their pictures to my right. And thanks for watching.